What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Blue Blood Sports TV. It's your boy, Blue. I'm in the building. You know what I'm saying? At work, as usual. You already know what it is, man. You know what I mean? But, um, I don't know if y'all... I'm not at home right now, so I can't give y'all the usual contact and pictures and all that stuff. You know what I mean? But, um, I saw a video made by, um, Boxing Ego. Shout out to Boxing Ego. But um, I saw some pictures of Deontay, um, of uh, Luis King Kong Ortiz, man, training, man. Dude is taking this shit serious. He is taking this serious. You hear me? This is going to be an epic fight. Deontay Wilder versus Luis King Kong Ortiz. And to all the people saying that... um. Insulting Deontay Wilder saying he ain't fight nobody. Uh the the dudes that he fought, you know, um his record, he don't got nobody on his record. Well guess what? Only person he got on his record is Bermain Stavern. Well guess what? I'm here to tell you. Luis King Kong Ortiz is probably Outside of Anthony Joshua and Deontay Wilder, Luis King Kong, Luis King Kong Ortiz is the third best heavyweight in boxing. Luis King Kong, I'm gonna say it for y'all again. Luis King Kong Ortiz is the third best heavyweight in boxing. He's undefeated. He's the better opponent out of the out, out of the four. When you're speaking of Anthony Joshua versus Joseph Parker and Deontay Wilder versus Ortiz. He's the third best heavyweight out of those four. I would go my opinion, Deontay Wilder, Anthony Joshua, Ortiz, then Joseph Parker. Why? Because of the boxing ability, the skills, the, the movement, the foot movement, I mean the foot placement, the foot movement, you know, um, his skill set, you know, um, his jab, his Cuban boxing background, period. You know, um, that alone is one of the biggest reasons that most heavyweights fear him because he moved he don't move like a heavyweight. <clears throat> he got skills. He don't move like a heavyweight. You dig what I'm saying? So, not to mention his power. Dude packs punch. He packs a punch. He got power. So, you know, if you if you match them against Joseph Parker, I hope I said Joseph Parker because I said Deontay Wilder, Luis... Deontay Wilder, Anthony Joshua, Ortiz, then Joseph Parker. If I ain't say Joseph Parker. I believe I did, though. But, um, yeah, man. You gotta go Luis King Kong Ortiz as the third best out of those four. So, I don't want to hear nothing if Deontay Wilder smoked Ortiz. Don't tell me nothing about age because... Ortiz was the mandatory for Anthony Joshua and Eddie Hearn and, and, and Joshua turned that fight down. He was the mandatory for that fight. And they turned that fight down. They even signed, Eddie Hearn signed Luis Ortiz to make the Joseph to make the Anthony Joshua versus Ortiz fight later on down the line. And he turned the fight. He it was a it was a fight by fight contract. He wasn't on a it was a three fight deal, but it was fight by fight. And they released him. What did he do to get released? I'm going to tell you what he did to get released. They seen him up close. They knew what he was about. And they was like, nah, they don't want that smoke. Not yet. Not saying that Anthony Joshua was afraid of Luis Ortiz. But they like, mm, not yet. Because, I mean, you seen how the fight went with 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 um with, with Takam and Anthony Joshua. Imagine if that was Ortiz that he got tied in the ring with. Imagine that. 
You know what I'm saying? But uh, on, the, on on later on, I'm gonna drop a more a uh, a uh, uh, a more in depth video about this situation, man. But I just wanted to say, yeah, this is gonna be an epic ass fight. Luis King Kong Ortiz, that dude is in shape right now. He in hella shape. You hear me? Dude is in hella shape, man. And, and he going to bring it. He going to bring it. This is going to be an epic fight. Epic. Because Deontay Wilder going to bring it as well. So we're going to get a throwback heavyweight clash. We're going to get a throwback heavyweight a throwback heavyweight clash March 3rd. It's going down. So that's all I got for y'all. Blue Blood Sports TV, man. Y'all already know what to do. Hate, like, and comment. Subscribe. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like button. And make sure you hit the bell icon to get all the new notification from your boy. Make sure you do it. So we can keep this new media flowing. It's your boy, Blue Blood Sports TV. Holla at me, man. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit the bell icon to get all the new notification. And most of all, make sure you subscribe to the channel. That's all I got for y'all right now. I'm going to break this fight more down later. I'm going to break this fight down more later on. Blue Blood Sports TV. Peace.